Hey, hon, can you come back here, please? You. Yeah. All right, what's going on out here? There is a dude, and it, it looked like a... Is either Ford Taurus or a, or a newer Toyota Camry. Okay. He is at least going 50, if not 60. Okay. And I fucking waved my arm, and I said, bro. And he pulled over right there. And they're both sitting He just here. called you in and waving a gun. Well, I mean, you can search. You can search my car, too. Hold on. But he fucking, he almost hit her. That's why I got mad at her. Mad at him because he almost hit her. And he was going at least 50 or 60. You got anything in your car? No, I mean, you can search my car. You but good, hun? I got a little bit of weed, oh, I'll tell yeah. you. Can you? I got a little bit of weed in the middle console, but it's I'm not worried about weed. I'm not, not worried about weed. I'm just making sure nobody's got firearms. You don't have any firearms. I can tell on that. Uh, All right, give me one second. Can you got your ideas? Uh, yeah, about 336. I'm secure. I got 2841. How old are you, hun? I? Yeah. You're 15. 15, and you're out here with man right, without. I'm with them. I'm with them. No, we were just over here and we saw this. To get in the back, it's just going. How old are you guys? It's my buddy. It's all my buddy girls. This kid Caleb 336, 1028, Charles Boy 96332. Charles Boy 96332 gave me right permission there? to uh, search car. Huh? That key right there unlocks the Okay. The silver one is for the door. All right, just hold up right there. I'm going to be down here in the. Did your parents know you're out here? Yes, my parents know I'm here. Okay. Did your parents know you're out here with boys this late at night? I bet you they don't. No. Who lives here? Me. Okay, does your parents know you're out here talking to these boys? I wasn't talking to them. Okay, so just you. Oh, yeah. And we got alcohol here. So do me a favor, ladies, have a seat right now until the other officers arrive. Because he, he's advising that, it, that you waved a gun at him, is what he yeah, said. I, hey, like I said, you can search my car, you're going to find weed, that's all you're going to find. I'm not going to lie. I'm not worried about weed, dude. I don't I'm not worried about weed. I don't have a gun. We my just want to make sure nobody's a got a firearm. My mom's a detective. Okay. How old are you? I'm 22. Okay. How old are you? 16. 16. So here's who, who's here to see the 15-year-old? Nobody's here to see anybody. He's they're here 15. To, he's here to hang out with them. I know, but they're 15. Yeah, this is my little brother, basically. They're, they're 15. Yeah, and he's no. 16 or 17, aren't you? What are you, a week away from being 16? Yeah. He's advising that um, he was down here, they are down here visiting his girls. A guy came well, by in a high rate of speed. 50 or 60 miles per hour. I fucking waved at him. He pulled over, he hopped out, started talking shit, and he bent over in his car and reached for something. I didn't see what he reached for because he didn't pull it out. But What's he did bend over in his car. It, it was a dark car, it was either, like I told her, a Ford Taurus, it's a newer Toyota Camry. Worst case scenario, it's probably a fucking black Malibu. That's the only thing I could think of besides that. But he flew down here at least 67 miles per hour. And I went down because we were sitting out here, we were, everybody was talking. And he flew down. What did he look like? I couldn't tell. Like, when I tell you he didn't hop out of his car until that, past that, what is that, Jeep or whatever? Once he passed out, passed out, that's when he pulled over. And then he started talking shit, talking about, oh, come down to the stop sign, this and that. Well, first of all, I'm not going to fucking fight you. Because if one is about to be 4th of July. Huh? So Those are the keys to the car. You gave me permission to search, and I haven't searched it yet. I was waiting for you guys to drive. Okay, so you were inside the house? Okay. I came out here to like see what they were doing. And a car came by and almost hit me and... Are you supposed to be spending the night at her house? Yes. Okay, does your parents know she's out here? Yeah. So your parents are up and they know she's out here? No. So they know she's here, but they don't know she's outside? No. Can you go get a parent? I'm home alone. Well, well, actually, my neighbors are watching me, but I'm at my house. Where's your parents? My parents are out in Eagerville. 
Who's your parents? My parents? Yeah. Where are you from? Payna. Payna. All right. You two can go in because I'm good with you two. Thank you, you can stay out. Okay. okay. Open the other side. Hey, bud. Oh, my my door's unlocked. Whenever you go to a search one, I'm gonna teach you a lesson. Go to here, you gotta put the guns right in the middle. Okay. His cars are bad. It's either you break them or you just take your gentle time with them. But I don't mind if you break it, honestly. This right here, this right here, this is for the key, so you can't turn it off and turn it off. This is good, this is light, that's the fog light. I love my silver. What's up? No, you're cool. I have the 81 cutlass with the 83 screw. With the twin turbos on it. Oregano? Oregano? Okay, this is more than a little bit. That's an eighth. That's from the dispenser eight. Okay. Has to be sealed. Oh, uh, yeah. it doesn't have the seal on it. And I broke it. Mm-hmm. You can take it. Hey bud, you might as well soak the stuff. <laughs> You can just take it. Yeah, I'm gonna take it and destroy both of them. Okay. Are you gonna take the grinder too? Yeah. yeah. Sorry, honey. Yeah. Alright. You, you can just take the marijuana. Okay. No, I'm taking the grinder. I appreciate it. I don't really got the extra money. How old are you, bud? What? Nice. How old are you? 23. Okay. I'm going to 99. Yeah, level 336, we're secure. We're searching the vehicle. We got permission. I bet you know, there's going to be some bad guy. Um, I'm going to talk to the director. 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 I'm going to talk to the
Clean your car out, bud. <laughs> 20, 21, 22, 16-year-old brother to see a 15, 14-year-old girl. And they're all here with no no guardians. You love a drink in there? I don't know. Anything to drink? No. No. Okay. Which one were you here to see, the young one or the older one? Oh, I was over there talking to them because I seen them. We were out by the thing, okay. and I seen them. Why this late at night? Oh, we couldn't sleep, and we heard like, so I came out here. I don't know why I did. I really shouldn't have. Okay. He said he brought him down to see you. Why this late at night? I don't know. He can keep the grinder. guys mm -hmm. um, be honest the older one I have not known for a while the younger one I've known for a while and how old are you 15 15 15 he's 16 do you not see where this is not looking right yeah what would happen if I called your mom she would be freaking out right now yeah, yeah so you're gonna have to Here's what I suggest you do. Since you've got a 15 year old girl over here, I got three of them with oh, no parents them, here. None of them are legal with me, I'm not gonna lie. Nobody's legal with me. I know nobody's legal with you. No, no. But the fact is, I got three juveniles and I got one out here talking to you, not looking good, because I guarantee you, if I call her mom, her mom's gonna have a flip out. So you, you don't need to be visiting a 15 year old girl this late at night. So I suggest you you want to visit her. You need to visit her during the daytime, and her family knows about it, not at a friend's house. Yeah. Yeah, this is, I mean, I've known him for five, six, seven years. Yeah. So, I mean, it's like my little brother. You guys, you guys know what time it is, right? Yeah. It's like two thirty. Okay. He's staying in my house. His mama knows. Okay. Right. How old are you, bud? I'm sixteen. You're out past curfew. Is there a curfew? Yeah. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. yes. Get home. Do, do what you guys gotta do, man. Just be safe, okay? Yep. We, don't want, we don't want anything to happen, especially like this. You know, you guys are just having a good time, and it all it takes is somebody else who's not paying attention, man. You know, you get hurt. I don't want to see that happening. So. And usually we don't got any problems down on this side. But that's that's what's odd, yeah. To have somebody come kind of flying down from here. Yeah. So. It's right. like I've never been through Taylorville and really had somebody speed ever. Because I'm not gonna lie, you guys are on your. This street. is a crazy block, man. I will tell you that right now. This is a crazy block. Not, like You're going to have some old people come chasing you down, and it's not going to be pretty here. <laughs> oh, I don't want no problems. Old people, man. They're the ones that are watching. Yeah. They'll, they'll, watch it. Yeah. <laughs> they'll tell you everything. Have Sounds good. Back. I'm going to go get my shit from inside and get out of here. So you guys been here at the house inside? Yeah, we've been here just kicking it. We Really, we've been playing Madden. Too yeah, long. he kind of whooped me. He got mad. By a lot. And I quit. That's why so, we came out here. Are you guys visiting just two girls or all he, three? He's friends with they're, all of them. I don't friends. know none of them. Like, honestly, I don't. I'm just over here to... Do you not see how this looks bad? I, yeah. I promise you, my mom... You, I told you what my mom does. I promise you, I understand that. I totally understand where you're coming from. I promise you. My cousin's in jail for 38 years. Because you got to look at my point of view. I'm a mother of kids. Yes, ma'am. And if I ever came home and found out some 21, 22-year-old is at my 15-year-old daughter's house you're and I'm not there, me? I'm going to hunt you down. Oh, I don't blame you. I honestly wouldn't be here 
but you want me to be honest with you? I drink, so I don't really want to drive. That's Here's the problem. problem. Are you sober enough to drive? He doesn't have a license. Are you kidding me? Well, it's a long story. It's because of my eyes. His mom won't. His mom won't let him do it. Do to How much you been drinking? A pint of E and J and a couple of shots of 99s. Oh shit. Sure. I'll be out at 8:30 in the morning. 3:28, 3:36. No, you're not staying here. Because right now, she's calling her mom and they are calling their parents. I doubt they really are. Too well, close. I'm gonna make them call, or we'll call them. Just for 43, the driver of the red vehicle is advising he's had too much to drink to drive, and the other kid does not have a valid DL, and he said he had to leave at 8 o'clock in the morning, and I'm like, uh, no, he's not. I'm not too drunk to drive. You got a phone? Yeah, but I don't have minutes. Huh? Yeah, but I don't have minutes or anything. That's fine. I'll give you a phone. You're going to call your mom. Okay. We can get you somewhere local. Or we can get somebody to come and get you, but you're not staying here. I'll stay in my car. Uber? You can get they're, an Uber. They're not going to pay for the Uber all the way to fucking... No, we're not paying for your Uber. That's you. Oh, exactly. We're not paying for it, so I don't give a fuck. We'll sleep in the car. Because technically, they can't do shit, so I mean... We're not going to drive. We're not going to turn off the fucking car on. So. Yeah. And she knows she can't do nothing, so... Legally, she can't force them... 328, can you come back to my place. location, please? They're at her friend's house, and her mom knows she's at her friend's house, so. Here's the deal. You're 22 it, with 15-year-old girls, and I guarantee you, if I contact, when I got a hold of their parents, they're not going to want you here. Okay, that's cool. You know, we've you, been good to you, and then you want to be rude. I just know the laws, and you're just trying to do extra shit when I told you I'm going to go in and get You're not them. going in their house. Oh, so I'm not going to go. Uh, my job is to protect the juveniles, and you're not going in the house. They don't care about you being here. That's I don't care if they don't them. care. I'm now involved. Involved in what? Because he's over here talking to them? Wow, that's crazy. No, you. I'm talking to them. I'm talking to them now? No. I'm talking to you? I'm talking to you? Oh, so that's two people now that you said I'm talking to. You just said you're friends with all three. I said he's friends with all three, first of all. It's on body cam, so you can get that right back. Yes, and you said that you were here playing games hey, with all, Hey, will y'all come back here? Because I don't, I don't like her. I don't want to talk to her. She's over here trying to accuse me that I'm going to do something with these fucking 15 year olds because He's I said to my stay here with no Hold parent. on, I don't, no, 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 stop. Oh. Let me say what I'm saying. That's, Why do you got to cut me off? Because I know just, how this just police works. No, just so the on. thing is, she wants to call backup. But the thing is, I'm telling her that yeah, he I knows don't. all three of them. I don't know none of these girls. I'm going to go in and I said I'm going to go to bed. But she wants to accuse me like I'm going to do something with them. So first of all, if you want to oh, do that, oh. I will file a lawsuit. Do you not that's, have that's permission to be here? Yes, I do. Because they, but they are not of age to give you permission. Both of their moms know I'm here. That's what you aren't getting. Their mom, they literally told their mom we're coming to get them and come back here. That's what you're not getting. Okay, you're just on. accusing just, shit, just which means on. I can file a lawsuit and I'll sue the it's, fucking city. And I, I said I was going to call their parents. There's no, there's no, first of all, there's, the, there's no you two reason. are the only one I don't talk to. First of all, there's no reason. He just told me your mom knows he's here. Does your mom and dad know that they are here spending the night? No. He just sat there and told me that your mom and dad, your mom... I don't even know them. ...gave permission for him to stay here. No. <laughs> what the hell? Yes. My dad's on his way to pick me up. I was supposed to be staying the night, but with all this, I'm just going home. But he lives in, I live in Springfield. Okay. So he's not going to be here for a minute. I didn't know they were here. You didn't know they were here? No, they didn't. They said they've been inside of your house playing games with all three of you tonight. He's not going to spend the night. And he said that he's going he's gonna to stay here tonight because he's been uh, drinking. Uh, is what I got.
Your mom doesn't know he's here. My mom knows I'm saying he's hurt. But does she know that these guys are here? No. Okay. For the juveniles, one of them who lives here does not know, did not know they were here. They knew that he was coming to visit her, but did not know they were in the house. They did, she does not want them here. The other girl, her dad's coming to get her from Springfield because she doesn't want to be a part of this. And the other girl, when I talked to her, if I called her mom, what would her mom say? And her mom said she'd freak out. What does the parents of this house say? Are they, parents are in here, Shelbyville at the lake. That's what I'm saying. If, if the parent of a resident says whatever that's fine because it has to do with the house but the, okay, well, the other two the other then, the other so two girls the other two you. girls or whatever if they don't belong here and they're supposed to be spending the night here their their parents can come get them and stuff that's but cool. you know what i'm saying it, well, it's it's I all about her. i said we ain't i'm not driving because it, i know the moment i drive even though i'm not drunk i'll pass the test in front of all y'all but i'm not going to drive and then get pulled over down the road not we're not telling you to drive. No, 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 no. We're not yeah, telling I mean, you to I'm drive at all. I'm fine to drive. That's what I'm trying to tell you. But I'm not. I know how this goes. I'm not going to drive and get pulled over on the way home. No, we understand. We understand. We understand. So, you're being, you're I'm being also not paying for that, that Uber. Aspect. And I'm no, not. No, no. We're yeah. not no gonna, we, we said we will get you to another location if you need to be. So where are you going to take me a ride to? Because I don't need a ride. That's what I'm trying to tell you. I don't need a ride at all. You're wanting to sleep in the car tonight. We're sleeping in the fucking car. I don't yes. care. Okay. But yeah, if you, you want, want to sleep in the car, that's fine. Town, if you yeah. have somewhere you'd rather go, it's more comfortable. I didn't know if you knew anybody else here in town or not. I don't know nobody. Okay. I literally, came cars, here, right? I literally came here to have him hang out with some girls. But that's yeah, if, if okay. you want to sleep in the car, by all means, we have every right to sleep in the yep. car. We're fine. It's just, yeah. I've slept in the car before. It's not fine. I would yeah. drive home, but I'm just not going to drive home and get pulled over and then have to have do test all over. Yeah. I'll other, do my test other, right now if you guys... Hold on, hold on a second real quick, though. Uh, other than alcohol, have you smoked marijuana tonight? Like, probably at least four or five hours ago. Four or five hours? Okay. At least. You understand it stays in your system for for a long time, it right? It stays in your system for 30 days. So, I mean, no, if no, you're no, going to no, get no. pulled over for 30 days, or, I mean, you're going to get tested positive. Hold, hold on a second. <laughs> yes, it does stay in your, in your bloodstream and stuff. Uh, yeah, like a piss test and stuff, yeah, it'll stay in your system for so long, right? Okay. But the effects of smoking marijuana stays in your system. Yeah, when I get pulled up, whenever I've got pulled over, they said four to six hours. Yeah. Okay, well, that's not true, but okay. Well, I was just so, saying what So if you smoked the last four, so if you were in the, well, I understand that. The effects are still going to happen. You're still going to have effects. One girl, I got it. Dad coming from Springfield. The other one, I'm gonna have her mom and dad. Call, have her call mom and dad that are in Shelby. Well, they're camping out there, and the other saying. one's from Payne. I'm gonna have you're her gonna, call. You're mom. not gonna feel the effects. So I can give them a heads up of what's going on there. Right, it's like four hours, right? But because he's like, I'm gonna go spend the night inside and go to sleep. And I'm like, uh, no, there's no guardian here. He goes, well, I got permission from both their moms, so I'm gonna talk to them, and they're like, no. Six, and one girl goes, I'm leaving. She goes, I didn't know they were here. Four and a half. So I guess one of the girls Same stuck him in. That's what I'm saying. So if, okay. I, if I was a so if, you, now, so if you sleep, so if you sleep in your car and wait till morning drive, then you'd be fine. Okay, but you, how many hours? How many I'm hours? I'm gonna set my alarm for that so I can just get back. No clue that they were in your house? They weren't in my house. So you knew they were in the house? What? You knew they were in your house? What do you mean? They've been in your house. Did you know they were in your house? I was in my mom's room. Okay. Hello? Where were they? Probably in my living room. Okay. Does your mom and dad know they're here? No. Okay, do me a favor. Do you got a cell phone? Yeah. Call your mom. Okay. 
Am I going to tell her what happened? I'm going to tell her what happened. Okay, what's her number? She might be in bed. She has work in the morning. Do you have any other parent? Mm -hmm. Where do you live at? My phone won't turn on without this charger, so can I go put it on the charger real quick? But she didn't answer. Yeah, that's fine. Do oh, you have your dad's number? Huh? Do you have your dad's number? I don't speak to him. Okay. Who else can you call? I don't know. I couldn't call my dad. He wouldn't, he wouldn't answer the phone. He says that I don't really have any other family members. What's your mom's number? Mine. Mm -hmm. What's your mom's name? What? What's your mom's name? She is, she is scared nice and my mom knows where I'm at. 
nothing I'm scared about. That is just full deal. They're going to be sleeping out in the car outside your house. Okay. That's okay. When is your mom supposed to be back? Uh, tomorrow morning. Okay. Like, they're going to be sleeping in this car? Yeah. Okay. My mom's are really deep sleeping. Hmm? My mom's are really deep sleeping. So is hers. My mom never really answers the phone in the Nobody has voicemail either. Mm-mm. So what even happened? Like, why... I'm very confused. Like, we got called to a red Mustang waving a gun. Okay. So we got told. Can I speak? Yeah, but Did you, you gotta see what. No. So we come out here. We see her, these two guys, and a Mustang that we were looking for. So he, they gave us permission to search for search. In the process of it, we found alcohol, and we find out their ages. You're 15. You're. 15. You're 15. How old are they? One's 22. Mhm. Mm the other one's 16. Wasn't there a gun there? No, there was no gun found. All I know is that I was out here. So how would it be then if it was if they were raising the gun? Mainly what happened was the gentleman that came by and yelled at him, and they yelled back at him, called it in that way. They were yelling at each other, I heard it. Like, he was, came zooming in, and he was, like, this close to hitting me, even though it was, like, on the side. And yeah, that's why he said he yelled at the guy, because he almost yeah, hit you. Yeah, because he almost hit me, even though I was, like, on the side. And he started yelling at him, and he got out of his car, like, down there, and started, like, calling him all these names and stuff. And then he drove off, and he goes, something about, if you want to fight, my house is down the road. Some, 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 Like, something. I think I know the 16-year-old, but I do not know the other one at all. Like, I've not seen him my whole life. Okay. Give me one second, let me talk to my sergeant. I'll go and shake the voice and I'll call each phone, phone number 12 times. They're, they're sleeping in the car. Yeah, those fellows are going to sleep in the car. So, the question is, where's the last one? He's like, I got one. He's like, all right, man. Should she stay at the house? With well, they're, them three are there. The the one on the other side of the fence, her dad's coming all the way to Springfield to pick her up. This one's from Pena. This is the one that was out here talking to the boys. The other two girls didn't know they were out here. Um, they were asleep in another room. Amy, would you be so kind as to run this female back to Thana? To be honest, when there's only one of us available right now? Fair enough. Sorry. Okay, it's not. I guess that's not your job. So, well, I think I blew up their phone numbers yeah. enough, so. Let, well, I mean, let them stay inside. Yeah, let them stay inside.